It's the summer of 1950 and everyone is eager to escape from their classes in Withville, Virginia. With the hot summer days ahead, the best place to be is at the pool with all your friends. But suddenly, horror strikes. Movie theaters are shut down, baseball games were canceled, and panicking parents kept their kids indoors, anything to keep them safe from an invisible invader. Outsiders sped through town with their windows rolled up and bandanas covering their faces. The ones who couldn't escape the perpetrator were left paralyzed, and some died in the wake of the devastating and contagious virus. Polio had struck in Withville. The town was in the midst of a full-blown epidemic. That year alone, more than 33,000 Americans fell victim, half of them under the age of 10. You couldn't move, you couldn't look around, you couldn't do anything but wait for a cure. So how does this relate to animal testing? With funding from the March of Dimes campaign, Dr. Jonas Salk set out to create a vaccination from the dreaded polio epidemic that was striking the American nation alongside his biggest asset, the monkey. Monkeys were used in polio vaccine creation to test the effectiveness of the vaccine. Salk administered his test trials of his vaccine in monkeys and was able to come to the conclusion that it was, in his own words, safe, effective, and potent. This testing alone saved countless human lives by preventing bad vaccines from having negative side effects in the already suffering children. So tell me, is an effectiveness test in a monkey really worse than the extreme physical and emotional pain that these children had to face day after day? No, it's not. 